<laughs> um, you mentioned before some of the things that you really enjoy doing is building relationships. Right. Now, yes. building relationships also require building rapport. Oh, yeah. How do you do both? How do you build um, rapport and then maintain the relationship? Oh, that's a brilliant question. So um, I would say building rapport is has always been a strength of mine. And one of the key factors I use, I think, is humor. I think humor is a great way to build rapport with people. Of course, you can go too much <laughs> and, then, and then you lose integrity. <laughs> a balance I've been trying to walk on for some time. But um, yeah, I think, I think people in general uh, relate to me um, because they see that I have you know, maybe a higher energy and, you know, there's, there's a, a humorous side to me and that just diffuses, you know, some barriers I find um, consciously or subconsciously. Um, that's, that's kind of been my way in. And I don't know, being, being a British man <laughs> and we have the, uh, the British humor. <laughs> um, it, I, I would say it's a, even a cultural aspect that, uh, you know, British people tend to build rapport by cracking a few jokes. You know, I can go into a shop, just say a few comments here and there, you know, we're bantering and it's, ah, oh, it's fantastic. I love it. <laughs> um, and so from there, once you get that connection, the initial rapport going, of course, you, you can't just keep it at that, that level. And so um, one thing I do is in general, I just, I like to just, get to the deep stuff let's just just go <laughs> go into it i don't mind <laughs> uh and so once once people kind of understand that i'm there because i want to take genuine interest in what they're saying you know i want to get to know people this is it's always been the case you know tell me your story everyone's got a story um and i just want to hear it and uh so i i just go jumping right in and then the maintenance of a relationship of course is very complex um in some regards but um for me i think it's always the idea that you want to listen to people understand them empathize with them and then give them ideas or questions to kind of grow what they already have something like this and and then from there comes the, the trust, the honesty, um, these are all also important aspects, I think, to a relationship and maintenance of, um, but it's it's very different, I think, or at least I use a different skill set in those initial parts of building rapport. Yeah. Wow. Okay. I assume you know what tighty whitey is. A tighty whitey, yeah. I think it's like a vest thing that you, is it Not a tighty or no, or underpants. There you go. So all right. if you had to use tidy whities as a metaphor for success, <laughs> how is success like tidy whities How is success like tidy whities Oh, my word. Where, do you come up with these? Do you like at three o'clock in the morning? I thought I, I can't wait to put tidy whities in. I to, guarantee. To, to well, be honest with you, I, those... grabbed, I grabbed four things and I had tidy whitey here. And when you said four, I purposely counted from this way. No. Nah. <laughs> so <laughs> Yeah, that's it. I mean, if I was in your if I was in your position, I would for sure, no matter what it is, it's everything's tighty whitey. <laughs> oh no, it's not. I'm not I'm not that mean. I got Lego and chalkboard and cast. So. Ah, ah, okay. Tighty. I just knew a 50-50 chance you would have gotten tighty whitey. So I really wanted to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> you could have been nice to me though, Fong. Oh, you're showing your true colors. Okay. Um, <laughs> success like a tidy whitey. Oh my word! You really. I mean, I've got to be PG as well. I can't, you know, say rude things on your lovely podcast. Uh, so, uh, come on, I, I can think of something here. <laughs> tidy whiteys. How is success like tidy whiteys? Um, okay. <laughs> Sometimes, in order to be successful, you just have to tighten up on things in your uh, 
career path and focus in on them and prioritize them uh, in order to get to the next steps. There you go. How about that? You and your and making sure it's clean, legal, and legit. <laughs> oh, I could <laughs> nice have given you a better point. answer, but I'll leave it at that. <laughs> Nicely done. So that's how success is like Tiny Whitey's.